Hello and welcome back to a yellow case tutorial. We're continuing with our iChat training here and I want to show you how to customize and change your status on iChat. If you don't see your AIM buddy list, make sure to go to window AIM buddy list here so you can see it. At the top of your buddy list you see your account name which you can change by control clicking or right clicking on it and selecting either your name or your handle. Handle means your account so if I change that to handle you'll see my email instead of my name. Below that I can change my status and there's a little arrow that if you click on it I can pick a whole range of different types of messages. Now you'll notice that they're separated by a little gray line here the top being offline, meaning it takes me completely offline of iChat. So I basically log off of iChat and I cannot talk to anybody and no one can talk to me. The second option is invisible and that means that even though I can see my friends, they will not be able to see me. So by selecting invisible, I will become invisible on their buddy list. It will appear as if I am not signed into iChat but in reality I am signed in and I can see who is online at a time and I can chat with them if I like. Below that are all my available messages, all the green dots and these the default one is simply available and I've made a couple custom ones here that I'm going to show you how to make in a bit. Another option is current iTunes song if I select this and I have iTunes open and playing, it will post what song I'm listening to at the time. It's kind of neat. Below that is my default away message, which simply says away, and they all have red icons letting people know that I am, though I am online, I am not available to talk. All right. Now that doesn't prevent anybody from trying to talk to you. It just lets them know that you're not in the mood or in a position to have a conversation. You'll notice that at the end of each of these, the available, I can choose to make a custom available or at the end of the away list, a custom away. I can also edit my status menu. Now we'll go to that in a bit, but I'm going to choose a custom available. For example, You'll notice when I select it, the field here turns into a blinking cursor where that I can type in a message that I like. And I'm going to say, it's a gorgeous sunny day in Miami. And it is. All right. Now, you won't be able to see the entire length of it if it goes too far unless I click and drag the bottom right hand corner of my body list so I can show the entire length of it. So that's how I make a custom available message and you'll notice that it now appears in my options. I can do the same thing with my away message. I can for example I made one here that says dinner time. You can make one simply by clicking on custom away and when I fill that out it will automatically select it as my status in iChat. Now what if I want to edit out some of these statuses? I'm going to click on Edit Status Menu. And I want to get rid of that going for a run. I select it and hit minus. I want to select that dinner time and remove it. Now if I want to select to add a new one, I just click on the plus sign and not available for chatting, for example. Now you'll notice that, I'm going to go back to that a second, I can select the away menu or the available menu. You'll notice when I select one or the other, a blue line appears around it. So I can add new messages by hitting the plus or removing one by selecting the message and clicking on the minus sign. Now if I have this checkbox on, I can select it to remember all my custom messages or just my last 5, 10, or 20. So if you're the type of person that customizes them often, you might want to select the last 10 or the last 5 so that 
uh, as you add new ones it deletes anything above that number so anything if I select here anything above the last five will be deleted automatically I don't make a lot of these so I'm gonna just leave it on all so that's how you make custom status on your iChat and how you switch between them and edit them in or out very easy and fun to do